Right, hello everyone. So uh, we've just begun our day, a nice Sunday morning, a bit chilly, but this jammy one here, first signal, has just stumbled across another Frimza. Honestly, you just can't make it up. His luck is just, it's insane. On level. Here we go. Honestly, <laughs> just <Yeah>. crazy. <laughs> hey, Jeff Coyle. Oh. We couldn't believe it, honestly, just insane. I've literally only just turned my machine on. <sighs> so it was, it was just on the surface, wasn't it? Just under, yeah. Give it a low tone. I think it was about 48. It's just sticking out the clod, you saw that. You see, that is just crazy. In the sunshine, look at that. I mean, that is just insane. I put my glasses on so I can see it. Oh, God. It was shock. Absolutely shock. <laughs> I thought it was a bit of coke because you know, oh, yeah. just done by a light. Low signal, probably. Low as signal. Well. Oh, that is just mental. Yeah, I mean, you can clearly see some some writing there. It was the fact that you came out and said, I feel like I'm going to find gold today. Yeah, I did. <laughs> it's just madness. I'd say it's an English frimza. It looks a bit bent up just there and just yeah, it looks cold. like it's been bent. But obviously but it's just a sway it is like this yeah. in the end. I think it is still a full coin. I'm really hoping it I'm is. I'm hoping it is and all. I'm hoping it hasn't been torn. That is just crazy. Stunning looking. Rich gold Rich again, gold. isn't it? The colour of it is beautiful. Oh yeah. It's high gold, isn't it? It's, high, it's like, what is it, 24 Eight, carat? No, it's 70... 74% was the last one. That's kind of like 18 carat. That's 74%. It's it? <sighs> Just. it looks richer than that, Ernie. It does. Well, it's yeah, very me, high. me, 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 bulb was 74. Me tremesis that I found was around about the same richness. Yeah. So. Uh, get myself soaked to get it out of clod and oh, it Yeah. Is. Right. <laughs> <laughs> I'm hoping. I'm hoping it's something different. I really am. Mm. Well, I wouldn't complain if it's another eight ball. Any more detail? Uh, well, you can see the ring a little bit better right, now. Yeah. You can see the ring. It looks like. Yeah, there's definitely something coming up in now inside. Something coming up inside the ring. It looks oh. like a Whitman type. It does I look think like it a could be a Whitman. Type. Yeah. Yeah. Oh my god. That is unbelievable. Oh. <laughs> Stone away. Oh, you can see a really nice face on that one. Is there? To the top of the head. Is that the top of the head? I think it might be. Yeah, look. The top of the head. Facing, facing that so way. So Let's have a look. Oh, I'm shaking him. Wow. Oh. It's bent though, It's almost it? got like an orange sort of tone. It has, hasn't it? It's so stuck in there. I just, it is a full coin, isn't it? It's yeah. just stuck. Oh, oh my wow, God. Look. look at it. Definitely Whitman. This is yeah, that is a that Whitman. Cross. That's 100% a Whitman. Oh yeah. my God. It's got a little split in the gold. See on the edge, look. Oh, oh well, that's so it's just been split. Oh. It's still a full coin, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, it's full yeah. coin. It's just been caught in it by the player. You could probably have that straightened, you know. Yeah. Oh, I'm getting muddy here. Professionally straightened. Oh, that is just. Oh, I'm getting really muddy. Yeah, well, you just take your time. Take your time. Don't. Oh, shaking as well. <laughs> you can see that. <laughs> It's weird how it's got like an orangey tone to it, hasn't it? Yeah, you can, yeah, you can see the face now. Yeah. Oh, wow, look. Facing. That yeah, that's, yeah, that is the, yeah. Yeah. You can see the dressing at the bottom. Yeah, that, yeah. Oh, yeah, look. That's definitely 100% Whitman one. That's the, that is the weird sort of portrait Whitman as well. That's spray my hands. What do you want, sorry? Just spray my hands. Spray your hands. And then... Oh dear. That is beautiful. It's Unbelievable. Yeah. Oh my god, look at that. So yeah. the face facing that way? Yeah. yeah. I think there's there's an audio trident just in front of the face. There is, here. I think. Yeah, there is. 
just off off Flan, I think. They haven't reached that. Yeah. Time. You could get that professionally straightened, you know. Yeah, you could. Okay, yeah, it's just been caught in it, unfortunately. Yeah, but that can that can be that can be sorted. That is so nice. I'm just gonna dry it. Well, that's what you do the hobby for. That is stunning. Absolutely <laughs> stunning. Honestly, Honestly right you are the jammiest person. I know. <laughs> yeah, like first it. signal, <laughs> just insane. First signal on the field, low tone. I'm running 12, uh, 14 kilohertz on the HF. You're shaking. I mean, I know, I know, I'm shaking. <laughs> English frimsers are just so oh, rare. Look at that. And look at that. Yeah. That is lovely. That is just lovely. It's so rich. Yeah. I'm just going to turn it around so I can see it. I'll have a look at it myself. Oh yeah, look at that. Yeah, that's not the standard type of... No, that's, a, that's, that's a, the... That's the weird... I think they call them Sutherland 4 type or something. Yeah. Look at his face. Oh yeah, see it now? See it, look at yeah, Wow. That is beautiful. Wow. I can't believe you just had that first signal. <laughs> yeah, that is just. I mean, that is, Bad without a doubt, that is the luckiest <laughs> thing ever. It? It's just insane. You'd have never. I said on the way, yeah. I'm feeling gold, but I never thought I was going to. Well, yeah, you never did. thought it was going to be like this. Yeah. You were, yeah. You were optimistic today. and I know, I was. Not normally. You I'm normally. It's that face as well, beautiful. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I mean, it's not the most detailed of faces, but it's no, just. No, this type, I think the. They don't really come out. They're, they're not. They're not that great. The dyes are not really good. No, but that's how they are. Yeah, that's you know, how they are. It's not like it's worn or anything. Yeah, no, it's that's just the dye. That's how they are. Yeah, these are how they are. And that side is a is a normal. And you should better see the Whitman. I think it's, I it says see yeah. It should say Whitman. Is it M E N up there? Well, no, that says like M T I. That's why it's called Whitman because they've got the Whitman. Man eater on it or something? Yeah. There's a tea, might be, yeah, off It could be. It or could might be. be underneath the curled up bit. They've got like a, it's got like, a, it's, it's a cross with towels, but at one end it's got a, just a tea bar at the top. So yeah. I'm wondering if it's like a, although it's a cross for Christianity. Like it represents a human being. Like as if it's someone so standing it's up or Christ on the cross, because yeah. the bottom V is like the legs and the two arms coming out with the hands on the end. Yeah. And then the tea bar at the top is a head. Quite possibly. So it's like a, yeah, symbolic. Um, you know, thing of Christ, you know. Yeah, definitely. What a coin! That is unbelievable. It's amazing. All right. That's a very wide it's plan. So it's been lucky. caught there. Really unlucky. So it's, it's still a full coin, though. It's much better than having that break off or something. It's Dad, still the full coin. Wouldn't call you unlucky. Call you lucky. <laughs> so yeah, <I'm> exactly. <laughs> There's nothing All unlucky right. about this. I'm very lucky. <laughs> Honestly. <laughs> it's just I insane. cannot. <laughs> I can't believe it. I will. That's me. Oh no, it's my second gold coin with a HF coil. I've had the George IV yes. sovereign. sovereign. Right. Yeah. Oh, it's doing you well. Wow. And look at that. That's oh, a lovely portrait. That's beautiful. Yeah, it's not. They're not crisp. But, but I think that's not the die. I think that's the dies on this type were, were quite flat and worn. I don't know why, but that's the way they was. If you look at other varieties of this same. You know, type. That's how they look like. It's not. There's not. It's not meant to be much more detail than that. I don't think. It's just. No, it's a Whit they they're, a, they're a Whitman type, but it's a. It's a different die set, isn't it? With this, because normally with Whitmans they look like a big, it's round, a fat, fat puffer fish sort of yeah. face yeah, ugly. with <laughs> spiky hair. Yeah. But this is a slightly Whereas different this is variety. more of a, a an actual human being looking face, you know. Yeah. Yeah. So I think these were probably a slightly later variety of a Whitman yeah. type, you know? Not the early type, the later type. Take it any day, God. Oh, stunning. You're a gulp maker, you are. <laughs> that is unbelievable. Sorry, you're the luckiest person in this family. <laughs> I keep on saying it. Well, we cannot match wow. your luck. <laughs> unbelievable. That is just wow. Yeah. Still shaking. That's why you did a hobby. <laughs> so. I, keep, I sort of flicked it around, it was like just on the surface, I've got this low tone. Well, first signal. Flicking you around. Be, yeah. And then I'm like thinking, it's, I've, well, it could be coke, it could be coke. Exactly. But then I sort of flicked it around, I got my pinpoint route, got it, turn the mud over and see that. 
Well, just see that sort of side of it, just there, oh, like so hanging out. Flowered. Crazy. Especially for your first signal, you just wouldn't expect to find something Walk like Walk on that. the field, bang. Well, <laughs> that's what it's all about. That is just, yeah, mental. I think they're just destined to be the coin yeah. I find. Yeah, <laughs> I guess so. I've got a thing for sac early Saxon gold coinage. Oh, well. Guess we'll be gridding this area all day. <laughs> yeah, I think we know what we'll be doing now for the rest of the day. Wow, so. wow, wow. Oh well. Superb. Oh, That's a really nice yes. bird, yeah? <clears throat> Well done. Oh, oh setting glasses off. <laughs> yeah, that would help. <laughs> Brilliant. <laughs> wow. Yeah. Wow. Honestly. And wow. <laughs> <laughs> Cannot believe it. <laughs> what a way to start the day. <laughs> I might just sit down and have a cup of tea. Yeah, <laughs> just have a break. You need it to calm your take nerves. It, take it all in. <laughs> wow. oh, awesome. What an incredible find. <laughs> I mean, these these are just the ultimate. ultimate yeah, they are. are. Ultimate English coin. Yeah. All oh, right, apart from like the Henry III gold penny, there's not much that comes close. It's, um... <laughs> I'm just... <laughs> Yeah, even I say I'm lucky here. Yeah, yeah, you are. <laughs> Keep telling you. Oh well. Right. Excellent. Let's yep. try and find some more, right? Yeah. <laughs> Hopefully yeah, we we'll do. Be good. This coin is an Anglo-Saxon English shilling or frimser of the Whitman type and is associated with the Crondall period between circa 620 to circa 645 AD. And this is the Sutherland 4.i subvariety. Now, just for some quick background, the Whitman type accounts for the largest number of English frimsers found to date. It is clear that the design remained popular for many years and there is some significant variety in this type. The coin on the screen is an example of the very first of the Whitman varieties struck, which were legible and well cut. The obverse depicts a fine bust looking right, with tied reef ties behind the head, a drapery of pellets and a trident on stand in front of the face. On the reverse, around a circle of pellets, the coin bears the legend Whitman Monita, meaning Whitman the Monia in Latin. In the centre of the coin is a Greek cross fauché. However, over time, the dyes for this variety devolved. This leads us to the coin unearthed in the video. The style was similar to the previous example shown, which places it in the early phase of production. On the obverse, the bust is still of the same profile, but it is a little cruder in nature. Then on the reverse, the same design, but the legend is now blundered. Over the continued production of the Whitman type in the mid seventh century, the portrait soon becomes stylized and the legend completely blundered. The coin now on the screen is an example of this. The obverse depicts a stylized portrait with a diademed bust facing right, reminiscent of what can be considered a pufferfish. The legend on the reverse is now even more blundered and neither Whitman or Manita can be made out. The Whitman frimsers give no clue as to where they might have been struck, but most individual coin discoveries have been made in what was the Kingdom of Kent at the time they would have been minted. This strongly suggests that they were minted somewhere in Kent, most likely in the capital city of Canterbury. Well everyone, I hope you have enjoyed today's video. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you all in the next one.